heavy rains from last night lead to flooded basements again. This latest round comes as voters are expected to weigh in on a plan to modernize the city's sewer and drainage systems. Probably MTW needs a David Charnes explains. Undermined, and we lost a 10 by 30 section right here. I had grass going out about 10 feet. And I came out the next morning and it was gone. South Portland City Councilor Tom Blake shows us the power of water. Four inches of rain took out this piece of his waterfront property in August. To put it simply, the entire city is extremely wet. All the water has turned costly, fixing Blake's property, costing him tens of thousands of dollars. It's really overdue for an upgrade. Millie Peltier is talking about South Portland's outdated sewer and storm drainage systems. Over a foot, it was up over the stairs. Come in, if the pump wasn't working, it would have been almost to the ceiling. I can't afford to keep trying to do the repairs. We've done a total gut in this basement now twice. And I thought the second time, this is my fourth sump pump. More extreme flooding events means more water coming into her house. When there's heavy rains, you can smell sewer down here. Her sump pump also feeds right into the sewer line, overwhelming the system. City officials say an upgrade, paid in part by a $3.5 million bond, could help alleviate the pain. The climate change and the rise in the tides, we have a lot of people that have water in their basements regular. Blake doesn't have a pump in his basement. Instead, he has downspouts encouraging water to move away from the house, and he collects rain in barrels. So, from this roof, I collect my water in my rain barrels. I have an outside faucet here I haven't turned on in five years. As for both of these neighbors, they hope the next five years are drier than the past. And again, that was David Charnes reporting Pelletier applied for help from her insurance company for the water damage, but that claim was denied, though inspectors noted raw feces floating in her basement.